السلام عليكم ورحمة الله لعل الرسوم الكاريكاتورية السياسية باتت جزءا لا يتجزأ من الصحافة السياسية إذ إنها توفر بديلا بألوان زاهية للتقارير الإخبارية الرسمية ما يمنح راحة لطيفة من الخطاب السياسي القاتم على نحو متزايد مع القدرة على تلخيص الأخبار والآراء في صورة كاريكاتورية حيث تقدم تعليقا فريدا وتحليلا فوريا ومبسطا ولكن قويا للشؤون الآنية إذ تشرح تلك الرسوم وتكشف القصص بطريقة لا تستطيع المقالات مقاربتها وبأسلوب أكثر فاعلية من الكتابة أو الفيديو تحيي هذه الرسوم الطبيعة البشرية التي تحاكي مواضيعهم من أجل إطفاء الطابع الإنساني على الموضوع الذي تصوره ومن خلال الجمع بين الفكاهة وآخر الأخبار السياسية يمكن لرسامي الكاريكاتور تعزيز رسائلهم مع التركيز على الطبيعة السخيفة للقصص في كثير من الأحيان الرسوم المتحركة السياسية هي جيل متطور من الرسوم الكاريكاتورية الافتتاحية ويبرز رسامو الكاريكاتور المبتكرون الجدد مثل شجاعة علي من باكستان الذي حقق نجاحات متميزة في هذه الوسيلة المتطورة شجاعة علي معروف كأحدث رسام كاريكاتور سياسي بين ممارسي هذا الفن المعاصرين سواء في الداخل الباكستاني أم في الخارج حائز جوائز عديدة مرموقة وتقديرا كأفضل رسام كاريكاتور تحريري منذ بداية حياته المهنية عام 1992 يطيب لنا أن نستقبل من روال بندي في باكستان العلامة الفارقة والفريدة في مضماره شجاعة علي للإضاءة أكثر على هذا الفن وأثره أهلا بكم إلى حلقة جديدة من الداخل معكم زينب صفار تابعونا Shujaat Ali, the first digital aviation artist, illustrator of Pakistan, one of the pioneers of animated political cartoons in the world, joining us from Rawalpindi, Pakistan. Welcome to Mina Dakhil from the inside, Mr. Ali. Thank you very much, Zainab. Pure pleasure to have you always, uh, Shujaat. Shujaat, you, you. you are well known as uh, most modern political editorial cartoonist among your contemporary practitioners, yes. both domestically, as we said in our introduction, in Pakistan and abroad, with around 30 years of experience and dozens of awards and accolades. How did you first yes. get into editorial cartooning? Tell us more about this art, its status yes, uh, today, and the perpetual importance of the message it delivers. I, I think uh, um, um, I went, uh, the incident was very interesting uh, as I was studying in uh, and doing my bachelor in science. And I went, uh, uh, one of my friends called me from Australia and he, he said, why don't you try and take this profession seriously because we have we have seen you in college and drawing cartoons of our teachers and everything and making fun of them. So I went and I there was a lady, uh, chief editor and I, uh, uh, I straightforwardly entered in, in her room and introduced myself and she, she said, what is your experience? I said, I, I, I was drawing uh, caricatures for my teachers and something. They said, it's, mm -hmm. it's, it's a newspaper where you are applying a job. So, uh, so uh, eventually she gave me a chance and I took the job by uh, in a surprise uh, with no experience and nothing just because of my knowledge about politics. Uh, which came from my father and uh, because he used to read uh, daily newspaper a lot and used to discuss mm -hmm. politics with me and 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 the skill of drawing in political cartooning is a very important this this is a very difficult combination we, uh, all over the world uh, which makes cartoonists a uh, difference uh, different from each other because uh, as, uh, it, if you are only a, a good in politics and you don't have a good drawing uh, you, uh, you you will not be able to uh, to Im uh, impress your audience or or mm -hmm. viewer 
uh, you need to have both uh, qualities, uh, you know, in in the best level. So sure, it was uh, 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 that 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 is the thing which actually attracted me because it's a uh, it was a very unique experience for me also, and uh, and the fame comes with it, and the politicians uh, they they and the, uh, your audience talk with you and send you uh, feedback. That was the most beautiful communication which I also. Mm-hmm. started enjoying it since i started in 1992 uh, and and took the same year award so it was a communication which uh, a way of communication mass communication uh, um, uh, which uh, which gives uh, i think uh, the best quality of journalism uh, what, to, what to about the, the importance of the message the perpetual message that it delivers oh. You reminded me of a very you know, interesting comment in the press club, and when here in Pakistan, when I went and I, and I asked them, I said, "Why don't you concentrate? Uh, you stop concentrating on co- political cartoonists in the country?" They said, "We uh, we we don't think that it's a journalism." So it was a very surprising factor for me because uh, in the in the in the 18th century and beyond, 18th, 18th century in the Europe. The, the the art of caricature even beyond in at the time of uh, Leonardo da Vinci, he was the first one who introduced the uh, the form of distorted form of figures and and drawing, uh, and, and and then it it, it came from that uh, the communication a way of communication. So uh, in my point of view, it's uh, one of the strongest uh, communication tool in the in journalism in media. Right. And I I mm-hmm. so uh, it, it it carries a very uh, in, important and significant sure. role in media. Right. Uh, during yeah. your career, you were invited by uh, All American Editorial Cartoonist Society to speak about your distinguished animated cartoons, which you did alone without any team. Um, might you speak and illustrate your technique and style of cartoons and what makes them so remarkable? I think it was the, uh, a very interesting uh, experiment for me also because I have whatever I, I saw all over the world and uh, even in my um, um, career in Pakistan that all the political cartoonists they used to earn one time uh, fame and they used to sit and and, and rely on it and then just uh, they don't uh, move forward. So most important thing is for me is the, is is my uh, on thinking of of uh, continuous learning. Mm-hmm. That brought me to to the level of uh, international level that when I started exploring my field and and realizing that why the cartoonists are not moving beyond a certain line, so uh, that uh, that experiment took me to uh, 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 abroad and I I I um, I think I'm the one of the daring ca- cartoonists because cartoonists normally never move from their country, Poli- political cartoonists especially because. Um, uh, you don't uh, know about the level of tolerance you are working in a in a foreign culture and the people and it's a highly risky job so uh, uh, i i took a lot of initiative in my career that that what made me um, uh, famous in the world also now uh, experts know that cartoons do not only act as news sources but they can translate into a historical record of the political climate. Cartoons have the power, of course, to inspire, to outrage, and to amuse. Particularly in a time of tremendous volumes of media output, the ability of cartoons to communicate a compelling and comprehensive uh, message has undisputedly stood the test of time. In your opinion, Shujaat, through their Uh, lampooning, mocking messages. Why are political cartoons that important? I think uh, uh, importance of the cartoon depends on the knowledge and uh, you can say intellectual abilities of a political cartoonist. And uh, this is the area which uh, when I confronted with many uh, international cartoonists and I found that uh, um, they could not pick the real issues, or, uh, and uh, in, in through drawings and through, uh, through uh, um, I mean their own abilities, and they need to depend on other journalists, uh, journalists working whether in print media or in an electronic media. That that was uh, uh, I think that is the area which makes it stronger or weaker uh, regarding cartoons. That you need uh, the one need to uh, I mean uh, have uh, this. Uh, uh, self-reliance and you, you need to 
uh, have a, uh, this self learning uh, to cover all those areas and because i am the first teacher of political cartooning in pakistan also mm-hmm. and in uh, uh, and nobody before me taught this because uh, and and maybe i i believe strongly that there is no university in the world who teach uh, uh, teaches uh, i mean political cartoons because this combination is very difficult of mixing sure. mm-hmm. um, we mixing new news in uh, with with drawings so uh, teaching for uh, uh, this kind of a subject needs uh, even cartoonists Uh, himself to be a very strong in in, in explaining it to, to his uh, mm-hmm. students but uh, that's why i i i love my profession and i'm trying to proceed and go longer right. in it right allow us to stop now shujaat for a short break right. and then afterwards we will be discussing the challenges that faced uh, political cartoonists but after the break idan fasil qasir wa naoud la tadhu baidan بكم من جديد شجاعة علي one of the pioneers of animated political cartoons welcome back شجاعة they say Thank if you. a picture says a thousand words a cartoon says a million and they're an absolutely crucial aspect of news and how we communicate with each other a cartoon does all the things in one drawing that a newspaper does throughout all of its pages yet you believe that this art is facing mammoth challenges what are these challenges and why well in with the development of, of electronic media i think um, the most in, in difficult challenges uh, the patrons community is facing in my opinion is that they uh, they have stopped learning and transforming themselves into uh, the requirement of the new uh, uh, and challenges of the new media um uh, first of all we what i have been watching and and, and and my senior cartoonists in pakistan and the world different cartoonists famous cartoonists work that they are sticking with the print media and they are not uh, really um, trying to understand uh, they uh, uh, about the topics of the their cartoons there is nobody to to uh, to guide them and to, uh, there is a no no guideline for them accept the chief editors and other people tell them to do, to to do this uh, this uh, uh, cartoon on this topic and that topic which also includes this controversial uh, cartoons on religion also that is the area mm-hmm. where the cartoonists fall, fall victim of 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 people uh, who, who want to use them uh, uh, for their purposes so that for that a certain propaganda that, you mean exactly mm-hmm. so that, that is because uh, because cartoonists don't have a strong uh, strong uh, you know personality strong opinion strong that they can convince and they can ask the people please let us let us do our job so cartoonists fall into in, into this uh, uh, i mean trap of becoming very uh, very uh, quickly famous and very quickly uh, you know rich and everything so these short shortcuts uh, are 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 creating a lot of problem for themselves plus i uh, the thing which may, uh, which still surprises me in the international media including al jazeera and many other news channel in in our region also that they are not uh, appreciating this art but they are we are blocking cartoonists because of their fame and their hard hitting command which is uh, which is very a very a very good journalism because but uh, why when I, when why shujaat this is taking place this is i uh, this is something which you can say is because of uh, of uh, corporate media i mean uh, pe- uh, all over the world people are more inclined in in getting um, i mean moving towards uh, money based things and and, um, and moving away from the basic rules of journalism as we used to have in the past so the new trend setters are not actually the good uh, good uh, leaders uh, leading uh, this profession in the right direction Mm-hmm. so that is uh, the thing which which makes me um, uh, 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 i mean i think that there should be a guideline and there should be uh, 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 societies of, of political cartoonists in the world uh, who uh, mm-hmm. uh, can lift this uh, lift this issue and and save themselves and their profession because it right. is equally 
maybe in maybe Poland, maybe uh, like you can start this society and you can set yes. the guidelines yes. for this yes. profession because what you are one of the pioneers uh, yes, uh, of I this uh, specific beautiful art as the first uh, courtroom sketch artist of Pakistan and the first yes. teacher of political cartooning also in your country yes. you have seized yes. every opportunity to pass on this new style to others today you utilize yes. this time of staying home during the coronavirus crisis to help people learn different skills including the art of aviation caricatures can you highlight yes. how you impart your knowledge to emerging artists, uh, Shujat? I, I, uh, Zainab, I, I tried all the ways in, uh, I think I, I'm, I'm trying my best in, in a, in a more, most difficult situation in Pakistan when we don't have a proper internet and we don't have all those facilities which I, I used to enjoy abroad and you know, working while uh, in 16 years in Qatar. Um, uh, that environment uh, we don't have here, but I'm trying from my side as a best to convey. I I I'm, I recently hold an, uh, a short course for two uh, two, 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 two three weeks uh, in a national art art gallery. It was the first of its kind, and people were really impressed, and they, they sent their children. And it was open for all all sort of ages, and from a, a, a small young boy to, to to adults, everybody. And uh, the way I used, uh, I, I took them. It was all based on my own own uh, knowledge, uh, uh, from normal simple drawing to to, to to distort it into a form of caricature. It's a very shortcut in a very shortcut way. I told them uh, how they can, uh, and they they loved it. Uh, they, because there was nobody before me who can merge these things, taking from a music, uh, uh, um, I mean, uh, 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 a sketch or simple mm -hmm. drawing. To, uh, to animation and and how to distort them in in computers also this uh, they really enjoyed and people wanted me to to teach them more uh, uh, but um, um, uh, I have uh, my channel and uh, I'm, I'm unable to work uh, for my YouTube channel uh, up till now because of uh, the Air Force job uh, the digital aviation history I'm creating the chief of air stuff called me. And he said, "We need your uh, digital uh, drawing because you you are very best in it." So uh, they loved my art, and and they put a lot of responsi responsibility on me to to uh, document their history in sure. digital form. Mm -hmm. So that that that, uh, that uh, took uh, all of my concentration away from political cartooning. But I have my commitment, and I told them, "Look, I have 27, 30 years in in, in political cartooning with the award. So so please uh, 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 give me a time so that I can." serve my my field also sure. so inshallah uh, you you are right uh, i will be inshallah opening a society uh, and you set the guidelines too. Now, uh, Shujaat, yes. uh, political cartoons play a role in the political uh, discourse of a society that provides for freedom of speech uh, and of the press. Uh, their main purpose, though, is not to amuse. Uh, but, but to persuade you and to sway your opinion toward the cartoonist point of view. While highlighting the important role of cartoons in forming uh, public opinion, how did you confront the storm provoked deliberately by the abhorrent Danish cartoons in international media desecrating the uh, prophet of Islam, uh, Muhammad, peace be upon him? Yes. It was a very interesting uh, incident, and uh, and fortunately, I, um, I I went and I confronted them. When uh, they they took me uh, um, uh, and, and called me for one hour, one hour interview with this one of this Danish cartoonists uh, during that time in 2005, uh, and and, uh, and uh, they, uh, uh, that cartoonist was uh, failed to answer my my question when I asked him. I said, look. There is a, they should not there should be parameters where, in cartooning when you, you uh, there are certain things you have you don't have to touch them including religion and i gave him the best example from my own mm -hmm. cartoons that uh, that one of uh, in one of my cartoon i i paid tribute to uh, to to late pope or uh, pope john paul ii uh, when he died on on his peacekeeping efforts in the world and and people started calling al jazeera and they wanted to buy that animation Mm -hmm. and, and they loved the sound uh, sound in it and the idea of it and uh, that guy that cartoonist was uh, speechless when i and i told him mm -hmm. and i told him that look uh, look there 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 should be a, a, a parameter there should be a, a consensus between the cartoons that we will not create a controversial thing but 
there are a lot of things to, uh, are lying there people uh, cartoonists are not paying attention up till now environment um, or or uh, you can say uh, 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 so many things are uh, wildlife and environment in in this area i'm myself uh, i'm sure. trying uh, sure. to um, to uh, uh, to apply myself so right. cartoonists are not they don't have uh, any guideline and they are moving blindly that, mm. uh, that is uh, mm. giving me a good that, opportunity to concentrate yes that said as one of the pioneers of 2d animated political cartoons for the web in the world what is your message to young cartoon artists briefly if i may ask my i would request people to draw because art is a therapy look as it is so many uh, politician in the world of famous politician jacqueline kennedy and 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 many people i i, I forgot when i i read the, about them they were spending time in painting and in drawing it's a, such a beautiful practice that in the even if you sit uh, in your closed room and and even in the, in the in the in this current situation of corona i have so much to do i i cannot tell you Mm -hmm. when you when you when you have a skill in your hand and prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam said that look a, a person who has a skill in his hand he will never be uh, i mean uh, without uh, food or or without sure. uh, you know uh, and so, uh, so that is the best example i have i have uh, experienced myself also mm -hmm. there is so much and, and there is so much excitement inside me that i can do so much and and, and life is short so right. uh, so uh, uh, this is my message to them that look life is very short try to so try to seize one. every moment exactly Look sure shujaat ali yeah. a trailblazer of animated political cartoons thank you very much for your exceptional talent thank you. and for proving to be one of the most dedicated professionals bless you and be safe thank you Thank you, Thank you. Always a pleasure. Always welcome. وشكر لكم مشاهدينا الكرام على طيب المتابعة للتفاعل أكثر. تابعونا على صفحات السوشيال ميديا وحتى نلتقي من كل فريق عمل من الداخل من كل الميادين. السلام عليكم ورحمة الله.